President Rouhani Iran's commitment to end deal depends on other parties' loyalty Tehran FNA Iranian President Hassan Rouhani underlined his country's commitment to the 2015 nuclear deal with the world powers, adding that this loyalty is valid until the other parties show a similar approach. We believe that the nuclear deal helps development of sustainable peace, security and stability in the region and the world, Rouhani said in a meeting with the new Czech ambassador to Tehran on Saturday stressing the need for all sides to act upon their undertakings in the nuclear deal. He said, we will remain committed to the nuclear deal as long as the other sides comply with it. President Rouhani noted that the nuclear deal has created better conditions for the expansion of ties and cooperation between Iran and the European states, and said, there is no obstacle to the development of allowed relations and cooperation between Tehran and Prague. His remarks came after U.S. President Donald Trump officially announced on Friday that he would not certify the nuclear deal, also known as the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action JCPOA. Apart from his refusal to certify the JCPOA, Trump also warned in his strategic review of U.S. policy on Iran that he might ultimately terminate the deal, in defiance of other world powers and undermining a landmark victory of multilateral diplomacy. While Trump did not pull Washington out of the nuclear deal, he gave the U.S. Congress 60 days to decide whether to reimpose economic sanctions against Tehran that were lifted under the pact. Reimposing sanctions would put the U.S. at odds with other signatories to the accord and the European Union. Iran's foreign ministry said earlier on Friday that Tehran had a very broad range of options for any breach of the JCPOA and would end all its commitments in this regard if deemed necessary. After Trump's remarks, European Union foreign policy chief Federica Mogherini underlined that the U.S. president is not in a position to decertify Iran's nuclear deal with the six world powers the U.S. Russia, China, France, Britain and Germany. Mogherini stressed that the 2015 accord does not belong to any single country, and said, To my knowledge there is no single country in the world that can terminate a UN Security Council's resolution that has been adopted, and adopted unanimously, and implemented, and verified, she said. The EU foreign policy chief said that it is clearly not in the hands of any president of any country in the world to terminate an agreement of this sort, adding, The President of the United States has many powers but not this one. She underlined the EU's determination to abide by the JCPOA, noting that the bloc expects the other parties to the deal to adopt the same stance. We cannot afford as an international community, as Europe for sure, to dismantle an agreement that is working and delivering, Mogherini said.